Welcome back, everyone, to another discussion about the anime that's coming out in 2021 summer season. Today, we'll be talking about the second season of I'm Standing on a Million Lives. So, since it's a second season, I don't really have too much to add. Since the first season pretty much established how things were going to go, and I'm going to assume you've seen it, or you've at least um, listened to a previous discussion about it. Uh, so there's pretty much not much to say. It's more of the same. It's more of Yusuke and his companions going to this other world uh, as they're summoned by the game master and solving the quests and stuff like that. Of course, they are given new allies. Uh, two new people get added during this season. Uh, Glenn, and um, it is, uh, what, what was his name? It's uh, Kitta, I think. Um, he's the, the delinquent that they meet at the end of season one. He joins right away. Glenn joins a little bit later. Uh, anyway, it's more of the same. There, there's not much to really begin about, uh, to, to, to discuss, I should say, because it's more of them just trying to survive in this other world, complete their quest, and survive because uh, as we established in the first season if they fail the quest or all of them die at the same time they die for real and due to that they uh need to try their hardest and not survive and it's kind of a uh them learning about the other world and themselves and figuring out why uh this is kind of happening to them you know uh and this season especially seems to focus on yusuke's like demeanor and attitude where uh, as we've established in the previous season yusuke uh hates the city that he's in he hates people he doesn't like them or anything like that it's kind of uh he hates humanity kind of thing and that's shown up in uh in the previous season where he would you know sacrifice his companions to complete the objective or treated uh the humans in the other world like they were pawns and part of a game uh, and whatnot. Uh, this season, however, it seems to be a little bit more of that, where uh, in the first arc, he even, like, pities the monsters that he has to fight, saying that these damn humans were the cause of everything. Uh, and, like, being real sad, he has to, like, slay the monsters. Uh, but, uh, he, he kind of grows, and the people around him, specifically the the, uh, the the two first girls that are part of the, the group, they really, like, try to make him less of a, a bad guy, I suppose. They try to, like, tell him that it's okay to like people and stuff like that. So he, he kind of grows a little bit throughout this season. Whereas he's not always thinking about sacrificing his teammates because they cannot die or using the people as pawns. He tries to find like the most, um, the best solution for things. And when people actually do, you know, die inevitably, you know, he, uh, he gets very upset about it and does not like it, uh, of course. Um, and a lot of things just kind of happen that like suck. But that's the long and short of it. Uh, that there's not much to discuss, like I said, because it's a season two. Uh, a lot of the stuff I would be talking about would be like spoilers for like specific things that occur in it. Uh, this particular one has two arcs. There's uh, there's two like quests that get completed uh, during this one. Um, whereas the first one had three. No, it was just two as well. First season had two because it was the uh, the original three of them and then the archer girl or the wind sorceress girl. I forget what she started out as. And then uh, at the end of that season, they joined the, the fourth guy uh, who joined up with them. Yeah, that's right. Anyway, so it's definitely going to have another season. I think that the manga is actually like, it, it's well, well established. Like it's, it's, well into it. Let's, let me see if I can look it up here. I'm standing on. If I just search that, I can probably find it, right? I know I saw it before, but yeah, there we go. I'm saying on Million Lives. So the, the the manga that I'm looking at right now is currently translated up to 62 
uh, chapters. And judging by some of the names of these, we're not too far in in terms of the anime. Uh, let's see. It looks like... Oh, yeah, we're not even to, like, chapter 30 of the manga. Like, easy peasy. Wait, is this a different one? No? The characters look different in this. That's weird. Did they... Wait, did they change how the characters look? <laughs> Between the anime and stuff? No way. Well, it looks like they changed how uh, the main character looks a bit. They made him look uh, less childlike, I think, in the uh, the anime. He looks kind of like a baby face in the manga here. But Iro, or Iru, the, uh, the, the blonde-haired woman, she looks pretty much the same. Interesting. Hmm. Fun, fun to know. Anyway, yeah, so it looks like we got a lot of content still to go through. I'm sure we could get, like, two or three more seasons out of this just from the, the manga content alone at the rate they're going. Uh, so I look forward to the next season. Definitely going to watch it. It's definitely one of, like, the... One of my favorite isekai that's been coming out as of late. Uh, just because the main character isn't uh, a baby who, like, is sad and doesn't like to get his hands dirty. Whereas this one, he he does get his hands dirty. And he, like, treats people like shit. Uh, I like the anti-hero kind of thing, to be honest. So that's, uh, that's what's going on with me. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Will be any things here, everyone. So check this one out. It's definitely great if you watched the first season. You'll definitely enjoy this as well. So until next time, everyone. There's only four more anime that are coming out this season that I'm watching that we have to discuss. Uh, everything else... Wait, four? Five, sorry, five. Um, five more anime to discuss, including Higurashi, which is going to take a little while, and then the, uh, the Ititen anime which has two more episodes left to come out i think everything else is on episode 11 so the rest of the stuff will wrap up saturday and monday and then the week after that i think we can talk about it at 10 and then i think also higurashi if not higurashi the week after that because uh, higurashi has a couple more episodes also oh my god if you've not seen like the most recent episode of higurashi check it out it's great uh, anyway, all in things here, you all have a lovely time. Until next time, bye for now.